The girl in the car window opposite me She keeps on staring at me Does she love me? How will I know? Will I ever know? The girl in the car window opposite me She keeps on looking at me about our school because we go to a pretty unique school. Yeah. It's an all girls. It's very unique. <laughs> yeah. We go to Greer School, which is an all girls boarding school in Pennsylvania. And so we are all from different places. I'm a day student, so I live about 20 minutes away. Um, so I don't have a special background as them. <laughs> but we're just gonna answer some questions about all girls school and boarding school and just us. If you're not new to the channel, you may recognize some people from previous <laughs> vlogs. Um, so why doesn't everyone go through and say your name and where you're from? And we're all in 10th grade, so. <laughs> I can start if you want to start. Hey, I'm Lou. I'm from Germany. And I've been here for one year. But I think- You're just here for one year? Yeah, but I think I'm going to stay the next year. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, my name is Coca. I'm, I'm from Wuhan, China. This is my second year here. It's really happy to the 80s yeah. channel. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> you see, everyone is very crazy turn. here. Yeah, I'm Maria, I'm from Spain, and I'm here since January. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> because she just stayed half year. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, I'm stay another year. year but yeah. yeah, I don't think I stay, but anyway. <laughs> She's like, peace out. <laughs> um, I'm Anna, and I'm from Brooklyn, New York, and this is my third year here. And this yeah. is Edie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you may recognize me if you have watched it anything ever yeah. before. So let's start with the questions from Instagram. The first question is what is your favorite class? So we could like go through and answer them. So my favorite class is AP US History because I love history, but also I love, I absolutely love the teacher and I find it super interesting. Okay, so honest biology, Dr. Murray. <laughs> I was also going to say that one. <laughs> favorite yeah, subject what? and because we get so much information and <laughs> yeah my like head is exploding after one period but that's fine and also Spanish with Mrs. Legal I love her because she's just the best and she has so much she positive energy awesome. yeah. I swear I'm coming in and I have like no energy and then she's like oh you be yeah <laughs> for me I really like calculus like, yeah, I feel like I'm more like a math person, so I can like sit down and do a lot of math problems. And Mrs. Kelly is absolutely a really good teacher that helps us better understand that really complicated math. Yeah. yeah. Coco just like skipped trigonometry. Uh, no, I did in summer. Oh, okay. That's summer. not true. She couldn't tell me like she what she did in trick. trick. <laughs> she was like, yeah, I took it in summer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait, you did you did it just because you wanted to? Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay. yeah, we are in trigonometry. Yeah. Yes, we're suffering. Okay, so I was going to say corners biology, but Luisa said that one, so I'm going to say physics that I also love it. I love Miss First, and she's so nice. She's a bit crazy. <laughs> crazy lady. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she's crazy, but I love her anyway. Yeah. I would say probably AP statistics. Um, and like Coco said, I'm like a math person um and i just like i think it's really cool like there's so many like real world applications that i never thought about yeah. So, yeah. what is your favorite thing about greer okay my favorite thing about greer is either the campus or the people i mean the people are first obviously but the campus is like really amazing my favorite thing is the afternoon activities so i do dance i do hip-hop and ballet yeah, and i also do the uh, recreational writing I really like them. Like um, for the dance, I do uh, I do dance on Monday and Wednesday, and dancing is my motivation of Monday to go to yeah, school. Yeah, she's rocking it. <laughs> Seriously, she's like bam. <laughs> my dancing teacher Daniel is super nice. She's awesome. So my favorite thing about Greer is like there are lots of international, like it's really international and you get to know like people from all over the world. Yeah. And yeah, I do love that a lot. Yeah. And you get exposed to like so many different countries or yeah. cultures and countries through those people. 
Yeah, uh, so like my favorite thing, of course, the activities and the people and the trips. I really like, so I'm yeah, going on my first hike yeah. this weekend oh. and I'm so excited. Yeah, we're going tomorrow. And like, <laughs> she is the first person I met out of Barcelona because she's from Barcelona. No, I'm not from Barcelona. She always... Uh, people think that in Spain we only have Barcelona and Madrid. No, no, I'm from Valencia. Thanks. I would say my favorite part is, and it's like why I chose to come to Greer, is like the music department. Because um, I have been playing violin all my life and I like that I'm able to do that here and have like a really good schedule. Because like in New York I had to like run around all the time, but like here I am able to do like three, sometimes four like classes. Of music in a day, mm -hmm. which I don't oh think I was. Yeah, and like I'm still able to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> always good, always good. Favorite uh, or drink recommendations from the coffee house or favorite drinks? Oh, I got the okay, yes. the <laughs> vanilla iced latte or cam uh, I caramel. So yeah. Cool. Yep. Yep, I'm sorry, Luisa. I knew someone was going to say it, and I was like, I forgot to fit this one. I would say the cookies and cream milkshake. Is That's not good. But wait, yeah. there's cookies and cream, and then there's Oreos. And I'm talking the Oreos one. It may sound like the same thing, but they're different, and the Oreos mm -hmm. is so much better. Mm -hmm. And we had the shamrock shake yesterday, and it was really, really good. I don't know how long they'll have it, but it was really good. Yeah. Okay, and for all for all people who doesn't like that, what they just said, there are bubble teas and they're really good. Oh, coconut so, bubble tea. Yes, and they're the, the best. Bubble tea, very very good. Do you all plan to stay until you graduate? So for me, yes, I've been going here since the beginning of ninth grade, so I plan on staying until graduation. But what about you guys? Yeah, and this actually yeah, varies. I'm like staying. for a lot of international yeah. students, sometimes they'll come for a year and then sometimes they'll come until graduation, so it just kind of depends. Yeah, I'm planning on staying. I'm staying. Yeah, I'm not staying, <laughs> but oh, I stay. I'll come and visit you. But the thing is, I want to go like to university in Spain, and for that, I need like to do the last two years in Spain because yeah. there's like a big exam at the end that I need to do. Yes or yes. Yeah. If I'm here, I'm not going to pass that. Exam. <laughs> oh. I need to pass it. Yeah, the same as in Germany. So actually, I would do my graduation, but if I would do my graduation here, I had to do another like test in Germany yeah, to get out of like, university. It's really and I really like like to stay another year, and then I just finish another year, like a year longer here. No, a year longer in Germany. But that's like no problem, so yeah. Alright, so that's all the questions we have on Instagram, so we can kind of make some up now. <laughs> Good question is what is your favorite after school activity? Because for us, we're required to do an activity or sport or something like that four days a week. And a lot of people have stuff five days a week still, but four days a week we have to do something after school. And I think most people have like a couple of things lined up in their <laughs> afternoons. <laughs> um, so for me, I have personal fitness and select singers. So I really enjoy personal fitness because I like to work out and so doing that at school is really nice. But also select singers is really cool to like make friends through singing and get better at singing. So probably select singers. Dancing, obviously. So there are lots of hip hop. Dancers. Yay. <laughs> Yay. It's amazing. <laughs> yes. Hip hop, jazz, everything. It's just like so amazing. Do you know <laughs> how we suffer in the warm up? But that's like the good thing. You stay fit. That's like the really good thing. I love all of my activities. Aww. Aww. Okay. I can't. That is so cute. Okay, so I like like I'm not in so many activities, like that many activities, but I like jazz and I like volleyball. And um, right now I'm going like on Mondays and Wednesdays. I normally go with a friend to play tennis and I love playing tennis. And it's like, it isn't an activity because we've got like no teacher. But yeah, it's really fun. Yeah, I would just say orchestra because it's like where we're all together. <laughs> No, the orchestra, like the whole music department is amazing. Like all the concerts and stuff sounds so cool. So the last question is, do you prefer all girls school or co-ed school? Because I feel like going to all girls school is definitely a hard decision, but then like the environment is definitely different than co-ed school. Yeah. So do you prefer? So for me, I prefer all girls school. And I guess this is kind of an obvious answer, but I prefer all girls school because I feel like it's definitely less socially competitive and everyone's very like focused on their goals and like what activities they want to do and what their passions and interests are 
and there aren't as many like distractions. Like you still socialize a lot and there are lots of like trips and dances and stuff, but everyone's definitely more focused. <laughs> I've been all my life in that type of school, at least like the first year I'm in an all girls school. And I've liked it like for one year, but I don't think I liked it like for my whole life. Yeah. Like I also want to Socialize. Interact. Yeah. 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 We get that. I definitely want to go to a college though. Like this is good for high school. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And I think that something that's great about here is like even though it's an all girls school, when you do go to college, you're so confident going yeah. into that yeah. Yeah. environment. So. Yeah. And you definitely have a, like career pre prepares you to still like stay focused in college. Yeah. yeah. Especially Greer, I noticed that really everyone here is interested in what they're doing and that is like such a good like um, talent like in life that you know what you want to do and they know what you are doing because most of the people don't know what they want to do or know what they're doing and when you have like a public school for example, I don't know, uh, I feel like no one really like pays attention and here especially I know and I noticed that everyone is paying attention and everyone wants to know and everyone wants to be like knowledge, like wants to have knowledge and I feel like every girl here is so happy to be here because we can be ed educated in a very good way and yeah. Yeah, and I feel like Greer is more like focused on girls de development because um, we don't have um, girl school in China. I mean, like here we can do dance, like especially for dance. I, I know the um, dancing department is really famous um, for Greer and um, we have the pre-pro um, company and obviously I'm not in that really fancy. Yeah, and we have a lot of chance to like challenge ourselves to try um, something new and some of people might concern that we don't have boys here, but we have our own drama. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's yeah. Drama. Yeah. Drama that's that's so drama. Dramas are everywhere. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. the thing. Yeah. It's like yeah. there might be not as much like boy drama, but there's still definitely a social life just with yeah. like different yeah different types of conversation. Yeah. So, and what <laughs> about you? So, Which do you think you prefer? Definitely all girls. Like, mm -hmm. yeah. And also like I noticed, you really try to face your challenges in like in the direct way because you have nothing, not like not no pathways or something that like lead you around it because you have to face it and here I really like notice it. And, and try that, new things. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So those are all of our questions. So thank you guys for being involved. Thank um, you. <laughs> Natalia, come in. <laughs> yeah. Natalia yeah. has been eating dinner behind us while we film. Yes, Natalia is from Mexico. Mexico. Yeah. Yeah. She <laughs> thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And have you seen how she does this? She doesn't like this. Have you seen this? She does like this, not like this. She Sorry for wearing pretty. Ow! Ow! Did you hear that? Wait, her. Are you serious? They're Mr. and Mrs. Sellier. They're her husband. There are two? Yeah, you know what? Mac and cheese. I don't oh, like bubble tea. Funny. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> I think we all want to be in an all boys school, but yeah. No, we don't. Pre, pre, pre -pro. professional. No, we are pre pre pro. No, post pre, pre professional. Oh, pre oh, pro professional. And Sherry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're like full <laughs> rap <laughs> This is like the fourth time we've done that in this video. <laughs> we have to have a count at like the bottom. <laughs>